getting some feedback later on and actually actively measuring something, or they're just sort of still left on for glass testing. Ah, pas ça, moi j'aimerais ça être à côté de l'extension, plugger sur 240. A week to code, but 5.98, not bad. Well done, Zwickau. One more team. Yeah, they got the exit code. But it still counts, I think. So their fastest time is 5.91. Team from Culture, they have 5.96. Not quite sure what they must have had a faster time before with their first driver. But they're still way off the time from Eindhoven. Starting to wonder if there are really teams out there who can beat this time. So we've got a combustion car up, and after that we're going to see if uh, the TU Eindhoven can beat their fastest time. So let's just see what TU Budapest can do first. We've seen them on the track before, earlier on today. And they get a time of 6.38. Are they going to beat their fastest time? Nope, not yet, but it's not bad. 6.26. We still need some more combustion cars out here. Our fastest time so far is 6.15. That's way off the time from the electric cars. So, car number 40 is going to be back for their final run. <laughs> See, last year we were in the 5.7s, but the 5.73s inside 5.74s were both combustion and electric. Seems to be a lot slower this year round. But there are still a lot of teams to come. <laughs> Let's see if they can get their fastest time in their last run and they cross the line. Six Congratulations for completing the wet pad. And that's the new best time for the combustion. Six point zero seven. So congratulations there to Budapest. Thank <laughs> you. 